Here is my new Formula 4 car for this season. As you can see, um, yeah, it looks really good. Um, looks a bit like a Mini F1 car actually, of course, with the, with the wings and the slits and uh, the halo as well. A lot of new safety features for this year. Um, if you come to the back here, you can see turbocharged Arba engine and also uh, gearbox. As you can see, you've got the steering wheel here. Uh, so to get it on, pull this in and it just slips right onto the steering column. Uh, gears at the back, so first gear, first gear all the way up to six, and then left hand side is changing down gear. Um, you see at the front there, quite a few buttons. Uh, you've got the pit limiter, um, and I guess that's one of the main ones. You've also got the start button, so that turns, well, doesn't turn on the car, but it uh, starts it up. Uh, you've got the rain light there for when it gets, um, when it gets wet. Uh, we've got, so it, in order to get into gear, so when you want to start, put the clutch in, hold first gear down, you click that button, and it selects first gear. So, of course, to get in the car, uh, it's a bit hard for me because I'm quite short, but um, try stand over the halo, and then of course, um, slip yourself in. Uh, it's a bit tough here because of the, um, the um, buttons and stuff going around you, but try climb on in, you can see you've got the steering wheel. So, um, yeah, that clear goes in like this. Uh, once you're in the car, I've got the steering wheel on. All you really need to do is just start it up, uh, select first gear, and you're ready to go racing. Spend a bit of time, car's ready, I'm ready to go, and I'm really looking forward to my first race at Brands Hatch.